Hey, what's up, you guys? It's me, Paul. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm going to be going over my pet peeves because I hate a lot of things. And I don't want to hate a lot of things, but I do, and it kind of just, like, happens. It's been really difficult for me to overcome these trying to be a spiritual bitch. So, yes, I'm going to be going over my pet peeves today. Things that just piss me off or people or anything. So, here we go. Number one, the first thing that really fucking annoys me is Jojo Siwa. I don't know why. She just pisses me off. I'm sure she's a nice girl and I'm sure, like, her fucking bows, like, make everybody happy. But, like, they don't make me happy. And I, I don't hate her. I just dislike her videos. I can't stand commitment. Whenever I have to get up to go to a job or when I have to like pay bills or like when I do anything I kind of just stop and shut myself out and lock myself in my room and not do any of that. Um, and that's why I'm in a midlife crisis and I've completely plummeted. I quit my job, stopped paying bills, I don't have a phone anymore, like I'm completely fucked. <laughs> if you were to think of the most white trash thing, that's me. I literally like, I lay in bed all day, eat gushers and like watch YouTube. Like that's my life. And shit too. Don't forget that. Another thing that really annoys me is when bitches leave me on red. I can't stand it. If you're gonna leave me on red, don't fucking text me in the first place. I was dating a person like this once and left me on red all the fucking time and it's like, it's like, oh, I wanna be with you, I wanna be with you. Like, bullshit, bitch. He told me that every day and I believed him. <laughs> My silly ass believed him because he will leave me on red again and it will end in flames like it did for me. So. Um, next thing I hate very much is when you say hi to somebody. But no, when somebody says hi to you and then you say hi back, and then they're like, hi. Bitch, I didn't text you and say hi first. You text me first. So basically, when men can't make conversation, it pisses me the fuck off. Um, I can't stand it when I shit and it's like creamy. It makes me sick, and I'm just like, why the fuck is this coming out of me? <laughs> it's, it's a disgrace. It's disgusting. It's fucking like, I literally would rather have like fiery fucking raw ass diarrhea like literally raw ass diarrhea then have to have creamy shit like it like it oozes out of your asshole you know like those fucking jelly things that like squirt it's like <laughs> and it's just creamy yeah that so just imagine that just peanut butter and that's what it feels like on your asshole and I have learned to have a very intuitive asshole because there's a little lot of shit up there. I can't stand bitches who are trying to support our shitty system. Like, I go into a place and they're like, you can't get your license, you're 15. Like, so? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> I hate bitches who think they're entitled. I don't like our school. Like, I don't like our district. I don't like our school system in general. I don't like school, period. Um, and that's why I quit like eight times. I'm obsessed with quitting. You know those bitches who are just like, I'm so perfect and like everybody's like, or they try and be nice and they like do it in a bitchy way. Oh my God, hi, I hear you got food stamps. Uh, I don't think we're gonna be able to hang out this weekend. You know bitches like that. Yeah. I got the shitty end of the stick like always. And I live on, like I'm living off welfare. Um, I literally, I don't pay rent, I don't pay bills, I don't do anything, I literally just sit in my bed all day and do nothing, and I think I'm doing something, but I'm actually not. God, we're doing fucking pet peeves. What else pisses me off? The thing that pisses me off is cops. I don't know why. Not all cops, because a lot of cops are, like, really nice, but the cops who are, like, really, like, fucking dicks, and they're just, like, assholes about everything, like, you don't have to be a dick. Like, I like cops, but I don't like cops that are assholes, so asshole cops. Or cops that shoot black kids for no reason. <laughs> Um, I don't like those. So I'm a Scorpio, right? And we all know that shit gets on my nerves and like I'm a psychopath and I'm really connected to the dead, right? I'm also really about change and I think in the way an eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. So like if you stab me, I'm gonna stab you back 10 times as hard, but I'm still gonna stab you back and it's gonna be considered stab for stab, right? When I don't get back in return what I gave, basically. I loved this dude once and he treated me like fucking shit. Like I was a chug of shit. I, I love that motherfucker with all my heart. And like I get attached way too easy. Like it pisses me off when Trump tries to act like he knows how to run a country. It pisses me off when people are cocky. Like when guys are like, oh, I'm so hot. I get so many chicks. I fuck so much pussy. Yay. Like I hate, I hate that so much and I can't stand it. Okay, we're going back to Jojo Siwa. When I look at her, I just see, like, basic white bitch. But when I look at Danielle Bergoli, I see Rainbow Child. So, I can't really, like... Okay, Danielle Bergoli or Jojo Siwa, which one are you gonna choose? Like, 
honestly. I don't get me wrong, JoJo's not a bad person. Like I've watched one of her videos before. She seems like a really nice girl. Like I just wouldn't want to be around her because I think she's still stuck in the old way of thinking. And maybe we'll have a collab one day and I'll just be like, um, this is so awkward, but like I hated you at one point. Or maybe I'll end up liking her, I don't fucking know. I also can't stand when people say that abortion is murder. Um, I never got to film an outro for that video, so this is the outro. Um, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, ring the notification bell, do all that shit. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Alright, bye!